What's up guys, back again with another video for my beautiful wife, Alia. This is an interview from the 1999 MTV VMAs. This is a rare clip. It was just uploaded like five days ago. Like, literally like, yeah, five days ago. And like, it literally has like 40 views, which is insane. Like, I wonder, is this like an actual like rare thing? Has this ever been like even uploaded to YouTube? Like. I could search real quick. Like I don't even think it has been. No, there's a video of her arriving. Um, 1999 pre-show. Oh no, this has been uploaded actually. Wow. Okay, never mind. This is just a re-upload. But either way, I haven't seen it. Um, man, just taking it back. Like, oh, I wish I could go back in time and just like, even if I couldn't save Alia, I wish I could go back in time and just like relive the moments I had first experiencing her music because like her music has literally like changed my life for real for real like I remember uh, listening to Try Again and um, Rock the Boat and it was um, Try Again, Rock the Boat and Are You That Somebody those were the three I had on the first day I listened to Aaliyah like I had those three songs on repeat like those are the only three songs I listened to all day and I remember, um, I remember watching the music video for Are You That Somebody for the first time. And I was like, wow. Like, cause like at that time I never like seen her actual face. Like I never seen her in a music video or nothing. Like, man, I wish I could just go back in and <laughs> just like relive that moment. Like that, that moment where I actually, you know, found out who I live and truly was. But at least I recorded it on camera and, um. Hopefully my channel doesn't get deleted either, cause like I got two copyright strikes, uh, and if I get one more, this channel is done. But um, let's go ahead and react to this Aaliyah interview. I do indeed, and one of the most beautiful guests here, if I do say so myself. Aaliyah, how you doing? I'm fine. How are you? I'm good. We're, we just saw Britney Spears checking out her outfits. Yeah. Who are you wearing tonight? I went to Saks a few days ago, and I saw this outfit. I was like, it's cute. And Man, she looks so different, bro. John Franco Ferre looks awesome. This awesome. is 99, Now, you're up in two too. categories tonight. Best R&B video and video from a film. Yeah. Uh, any Either one of those would mean more to you, you think? Um, if I was awarded anyone, I would be happy. You know, I'm just glad to be here. It's the last one of the millennium. I wonder if she won anything. Tonight, you know? uh -huh. and I could search films, afterwards. Now, you just finished a film. The DMX happens to be in as well, right? Totally. Uh, it's called Romeo Must Die, starring Jet Li. Wait, so... Me. DMX uh, does a cameo in it. It has a nice part, and we just had a really great time. So, look out for that next year. What's your part in it? I'm Trish. So, this uh, was... Love, Jet Li's love interest. So, sometime next year. In the meantime, someone I understand you're looking forward to meeting tonight is Trent Reznor. You're a fan? Nine Inch Nails. I'm a huge fan, so I'm looking forward to that performance. September 9th, it's be awesome. 1999. Have a great night, okay? And good luck. All right. Wow, I didn't even we know Romeo Must Die was made, so like... Fans off to my left here, and I do believe Carson Daly... I didn't know Romeo Must Die was filmed in 1999. I thought it was filmed in 2000, but... I guess... No, it was released in 2000. Oh, my. I'm so stupid, but... Um, that was an interesting little, um interview I guess like she looks so different like that's one thing I really noticed about Aaliyah like like throughout her lifetime she has like these multiple different looks and stuff but oh why does the phone have to ring now but uh yeah I'm not editing that out and uh if you guys enjoyed this video for my beautiful wife make sure you smack the like button subscribe comment with your to me next I'll be sure to do it as soon as possible love you guys and I'll catch you guys on the next one peace out